Welcome back to the pack, everyone. Slacker Jackal here with more of Kirby and the Forgotten Land. So I managed to get enough money to be able to upgrade this um, evolution type or <laughs> this power. All right, come on, let's go ahead. Blizzard Ice. This evolution will allow you to enter the portal for the Blizzard Ice treasure. Oh yeah, I think that was, um... oh, yeah, that's right. I forgot. <laughs> Let's see here. Don a beautiful tiara of ice and become a frigid force of nature. Use this ability to skate around enemies, then stop them cold with a volley of foe freezing icicles. Burr. Ah, God, that random yawn. Maybe I should go to bed earlier and not just get like four hours of sleep, especially on a work day. No, you're just gonna keep on telling me the same shit over and over again. I'm done. So, where is that treasure road that was like oh is this it i think this is it yeah one minute yeah just give me a minute guys like a literal minute is it gonna collect these yep What? Oh. Okay, so don't attack because that might cause me to die. Did I? Hmm. Yeah, I don't think I got it. That was terrible. Ow. Yeah, I don't think I got it. Oh, wait, what? <laughs> I actually did. Like, <laughs> just a few milliseconds away. Damn. Okay. Gathering at the Beast Council? Who? Ooh, woo woo? Ooh, woo woo woo? Please tell me we get to see him. Please. Oh? Well, there's Gory Mondo. Hi, Punky Kong. Now I dodge. Or just do that. That works too. Oh, damn, that is a lot. And he dead. Okay, so this is like a boss rush. Oh, okay. Yep, I, I thought so. be some other shortcuts I can take. Well, he is saved anyway, so that is good. Still gonna see if I can try to defeat them with this ice ability. Yeah, I better get that. Silly dinner. Huh, so that could actually harm them. Nope. 
Yeah, I think he's gonna die. There he goes. Ah, uh, poor Toonie Dillo. Hold on. Okay, I pressed the wrong button there. What the hell? I jumped. Okay. Sorry. Lower line. There we go. Down she goes. Be claw line without getting hit. Sweet. I did that very well. No. Oh. We got the Storm Tornado Blueprint. Now you can evolve the Tornado ability. And I shall go and do that when the time comes. Yes. How intense is this going to be? Oh. Okay, well, that was my fault. Shit. Oh, the giddy. At least I get all the... all these. Oh, I did miss one. Oh, I also beat a silly dillo in a minute 30 seconds. But you're deep into the secret passage, which was somewhere. And I did not see it because I was a dum-dum. Chapog. Charge those points up then. Zing! Let them fly. Jabhog is famous in the new world for its spiky spines. They were short and cute when it was young, but they eventually grew into dangerous needles. It'll jab anything that gets too close, so approach with caution. Gordo. We don't talk about Gordo. Hey, at least we stopped talking about Bruno because people still want to talk about him even though they don't want to talk about him. I hate to be that guy, but sometimes I don't get pop music. Oh. The Space Ranger? Must be a blueprint I didn't manage to find. Okay, why are you um, jizz all over yourself from this blueprint? Let me get some water. Alright, so how much is this gonna be? Uh, again. 800 go uh, coins, or whatever. The Beast Pack's final stand. Oh, they really don't want me to, uh, go up to Leo. Leon, I mean. I don't know why, but considering it's a, um, a line as a final boss, I'm gonna guess that his astrological sign is Sagittarius. It's a bit quiet in here. Oh. 
Just doing some donuts. Checkpoint. I think it's kind of interesting the further away you get the um, lower frame rates it has. It's actually pretty interesting. Water mouth pulled mode. Oh, hold on. What are you what are you playing? At? Oh, hold on. Oh dear. Hold on. I saw that. That was sneaky, gang. That was sneaky. Still gonna see if there's any. Hold on. Shit. Shit. Fucks. I'm gonna need a new ability now. Let me see. No? Well, this'll do for now. <laughs> Just wants me to glut out as much as I can. After defeating toads. On corn and milk, because... Uh, sure. <laughs> oh shit. Come on! Oh, hold on. I feel like it's a bit wor uh, pointless to go back here, but... Why not? Ah, ah, okay. I'm still gonna do it. <sighs> Fuck, I, I wasn't paying attention. Finally, I got something. Okay, there's, there's a mouthful over there. Fuck you. Wait a minute. I feel like I'm missing something over here. Mm, I, I don't... I don't think so. Well, hold on. I nearly missed that. That I did. I'm probably not gonna get all of them though, because apparently I'm not that observant. Uh, it's a crocodile. Down you go. Okay. 
<laughs> I just completely destroyed the boat. I mean, that's kind of a waste of resources, but... Oh yeah, well. I thought I could just, like, tornado into it. So apparently, um, nuclear bombs beat out tornadoes. Uh, that doesn't mean that you should ever do that. Um, certain people who may be watching. I mean, can you imagine that there are people who actually think that you can destroy a hurricane with a, with a nuclear bomb? And people took that person seriously. And still do to this day. Yeah. Okay, better be careful. I don't even know if these stages are at all liberal with its use of, you know, food items at all. Oh! <laughs> well, speaking of which... and watermelon. Yeah, my three favorite things to get at McDonald's. Ah, that didn't go so well. So as I thought there was a pile of money. And now the ultimate pile driver! Beat all the beasts in the starting area. Ah, uh, you wanted me to kill those subwoofies. That's a very cruel game. That is indeed very cruel. Oh! His royal nemesis, King Dedede. King Dedede arrived in the near world shortly before Kirby and his friends. It looked like he joined forces with the beast pack, but that's no excuse for his mistreatment of the Waddle Dees. And he seems way, way stronger somehow. Um, maybe he made a pact with the, uh, evil demons of the underworld. Please tell me I have enough to see Leon. Along with the bad guys, which I just watched, and I absolutely enjoy. Definitely do watch it, please. I gotta say, more fur bait this year is definitely what I need. Hey, I gotta find worth in life somehow. Okay, here goes nothing. Okay, well, I'm not gonna get any coins from that, but oh well. Ah, damn it. <laughs> and I thought it's so well, too. Oh well. I should have enough for the next upgrade. And maybe even another treasure road. So it's the wind ability that I already have. Interesting. Storm tornado. Ominous clouds. Powerful winds. This scary storm 
roars to life with the press of a button. Namely, the B button. Pull enemies into your cyclone by swirling into them, then attack with lightning. I mean, lightning's pretty good, but you can't go wrong with blood and thunder. Okay. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I don't think I got it. Fuck. Oh, that was a botched attempt, if ever there was one. Boss time. And it is done. <laughs> Way longer than it should have taken. In the presence of the king. Ooh. Yeah, let me go ahead and take this with me. <laughs> I gotta keep reminding myself. X is the top button. And it is time to see if he lives up to the hype. Hmm. And just look at all this. Very industrial setting, lots of metal. I would have to say his favorite genre is New Wave. Oh, hey, we got a DDD. Forgo DDD? Whoa, that's Primal Nemesis. Becoming a pig?
Yeah, you're fighting wind with wind. Okay, so I guess it wasn't Leon. Whoever is using a second level evolved ability. Yep. Like it's just like, oh, okay, yeah. Now, now I like the Waddle Dees. <gasps> oh, it's still the Wolfies. Don't worry, DDD's, DDD's got a hammer. Lab discoverer. Automatic language detection activated. Wait. Activated. English? Human language? Research began. A warp experiment incident occurred in this facility. Hmm. A new life form, separated from the main specimen, escaped in the aftermath. That new subspecimen has yet to be recovered. In the time since, IDF 86 has shown no signs of activity. It is now kept in a state of permanent stasis. Within huh. custom made eternal capsule here on the top level of Lab Discoverer. And here we are. Let's meet the ultimate life form, specimen IDF 86. Oh, that's Leon. Oh, oh. Oh, I'm sorry. <clears throat> Take a good look, Pink Intruder. Isn't this a beautiful sight? You're not even seeing the Great One in full form. They're incomplete without their other half. Long ago, the Great One granted the people of this world a miraculous power. Great One, you mean like... God or something? Those people left this world behind and entered a land of dreams. Once the Great One is complete again, I know we will also receive this miraculous power. We, the ones they left behind in this forgotten land. And now, the time has finally come! Oh, there's Alphalyn. That's right. This small creature here is the Great One's missing half. Finally, after all our planning and effort, we can help the Great One reach their complete form. We've dreamed of this moment for so many years. 
if you dare to stand in our way. We'll feast on your hide. Yes, Daddy, I mean Leon. <laughs> oh, Leongar. Oh, fuck, he is buff. Got a little more buff. St stop, stop giving me these feelings. Oh no, oh no! God, fuck it. What the hell? He's going like Godzilla mode here. Oh shit. Oh shit. Come on, I nearly have him. Ooh. He's done. It may be for the best. I'm sure my Leon voice was just cringy as fuck. Needed labor, open vortex, found workforce, brought here, and yet, error made, irksome peak containment. Well, that's kind of rude. Careful planning, now wasted, no more planning, no more patience, instead. Up! Oh! Everything shall be! Consult. Oh. Well, that's gross. Oh boy, we had to defeat Goo Leonga. Leon Goo. Or we gotta escape. <laughs> Fecto Forgo. <laughs> oh man, imagine like some little kids playing this that this has to be like nightmarish for them I mean imagine if my nephew was playing this would he have been freaked out by this I mean it's certainly not my thing but I'm pretty sure somebody is into this Oh shit! I, I didn't even notice. Like seriously, I didn't even notice. Fuck. Well, I died in the main story. Keep on waving, and waving, and wave.
There we go. I don't know how that defeated, you know, formless goo, but sure. Oh man, there's more? Yeah, it looks like we're going to be doing a little bit of overtime on here. Vectal <laughs> Elphilus. Oh, man. So we have to fight a space demon. I was not expecting Kirby there. Well, I'm trying to remember from the Kirby games I did play. Did they have like these? multiple form final bosses. <laughs> A little late there, Kirby, but hey. doing oh no nope stop 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 get out of the way ow I'm gonna hate to do this but it's not even at half health come on Kirby how hard is it to, to you know defeat this rejected Pokemon Oh, fuck. Oh. Up with. Gotta be a little careful. Well, if I die, I'll probably try to get another weapon because this. Uh, the DPS of this is like pretty bad. Okay, good, man. That's gonna really help. Oh, come on, both of these at the same time? Oh my god. Just let me have it. Let me have it.
No. You... Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, hurry up. There we go. Ah, finally. I defeated the rainbow furred mothman. Oh my god, is there another form? Such incredible power. Whatever it's trying to do, it's going to be pretty bad. What is it, Kirby? Whoa, is that... Is that your home? That's Planet Popstar! Oh no, it's pulling Popstar through that huge vortex! It wants your world to collide with this one! We have to stop it! But how? With a truck! Are we really gonna swallow that whole thing? Yep, we're gonna swallow an entire 18-wheeler. <laughs> what are you guys doing on the side of a building? Yeah, 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 yeah! Oh, that works. Okay. <laughs> He's not sure of it. Oh, this is like some Dragon Ball shit here. There we go. Is this Planet Pop Star? Everything is being pulled in. I need to close the connection between worlds, even if it takes all the power I've got. Hey Kirby, thanks for everything. I beat the game. Well, for the most part. Ooh, uh, posing. Uh, unfortunately, I don't see Leon guy here. But, if I'm not mistaken, there's a post game where you try to save his soul. I'm probably gonna discuss it with my um, thumbnail editor. My, my good friend. Uh, the, <laughs> the one who is like really into Kirby and gave me a recommendation for this game. Oh, that's cute. Most likely he wants me to do the end game, and I probably do too, because I love Leon Gar. Um, 
in, in a lot of ways. <laughs> I, I am typical furry trash, remember that. Um, it's nice that the Beast Pack are able to defend Kirby, and the moral of the story is just kill every moth that you come across because they are nuisances and will most likely destroy your world and alien worlds as well because they just don't give a fuck. Also befriend leopard ladies. Oh my god, that is cute. You see, he's being friends with a Woofie. He's being friends with the Woofie. Isn't that what we all wanted? That's all oh my god! Oh, that's sleeping together, they're cuddling. That is adorable, pal. Paying tribute to the video game company that once lived in this in this universe. They shall be missed. Oh. Oh, he's in his meditative stance. To be continued. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> okay. I mean, I know it's technically the end, but oh, Claraline's up there. I could possibly talk with her and the rest of the Beast Pack too. Also, see a band. Oh, nice. Yeah, most likely I'm probably going to be coming back to this game. So. Not officially done with this game just yet. But anyways, thank you so much for watching me play it until the initial end. Can't wait to do the post game and save Leandor because he is my new, um, my new furry crush. Of course. But with that said, everyone, thank you so much. And remember, I love every single one of you. You are valid. And you do matter. Take that to heart. I'll see you later.